My name is Holly Rosenblum and I'm a senior biologist. I am responsible for primarily our African penguin habitat. So that includes daily maintenance and care, feeding of course, and a lot of cleaning. Most of the time they're in that habitat that you see in African Hall. The chicks, as they're growing, can't swim yet. So we have a dedicated space built for them behind the scenes. Penguins are colonial species. They want to be with each other. In addition, everything else is intended to create a dynamic environment that's stimulating. Our two chicks are actually about a month apart in age, and that's huge developmentally for penguins. The younger one, Ozzy, she's eating a ton of fish. She's a little bit of a roly poly and she's really cute. She still is covered in fluff. Her wings are kind of floppy, they haven't stiffened up, and she's got a little bit of sass. The older one, Pogo, she's a very pretty bird. Sweet, but I think has a little bit of sass too. Recently, I brought her into the pool. It was very splashy. As they get older, we'll definitely continue to see their personalities grow and change. It's our responsibility to make sure everybody's healthy. This population is also a safety net population because the birds in South Africa are having such a hard time and do face the threat of extinction within the next few years to decades, possibly. This year, all the stars aligned and we got successful chicks out of them, which was really wonderful. It's a learning process. There's no what to expect when you're expecting for penguins. 